This is a Let's Took Plinia. It's uh, an opening in the ice. It's formed with the currents that come through. So it's kind of like an oasis for the birds where they can dive for food for mussels and urchins. Uh, the eider is really important for the community here as a source of food. People relied on the birds for their clothing. It's the warmest feather in the world, the eider down. This is how people stay warm. We've been doing a lot of research to kind of understand changing sea ice ecosystems and how it's affecting the animals and the ice and the people. And so normally rivers flow in the spring, uh, but now they're flowing at the opposite time of the year. Down south, people are using hydroelectric projects and it's working against the seasons. But how can we work with the seasons? How can we work with nature? The Arctic Eider Society invited the Google Maps team, uh, along with the community of Sinekiluak, to come and work with them to put their community on the map, on Google Maps, both through Google Street View, collecting 360 degree panoramic imagery of their town and of the sea ice habitat, and also by putting the places of significance to them on the Google Map. The Arctic Eider Society is using mapping in order to visualize the Arctic Eider duck and its relationship with the sea ice habitat. We have hunters in five different communities now working together to map out changing oceanographic conditions and sea ice conditions. And so by having the data from our programs go onto this mapping platform, we're connecting the pieces of the puzzle to be able to see the big picture. Scientists that are, we're collaborating with can help see those results so we can be combining the local Inuit knowledge approaches with the scientific approaches. The welfare of this community depends upon the Arctic eider duck and the fragile environment in which it lives. The Street View imagery is going to be adding another element to the storytelling in their advocacy that will allow them to communicate to the rest of the world about the Arctic Eider Duck. <laughs>